Hi, my name is Ray. Welcome to the plant-based garden. Today we're going to take some cuttings of uh, coleus and a begonia. Uh, the technique I'm going to show you will work with any uh, stem cutting for any plant that grows in a similar pattern. So first we'll start with this begonia. Uh, you can actually see here I have taken cuttings before uh, on this plant, but we'll take some more today. So. One of the things to do with this is there are nodes where every leaf comes out of the, the stem and you're going to want to take a cutting right below one of those nodes. So it looks something like that. And then just pop it into some water. When, after you're done, clean up the cutting. So you take out the midsection of the node because this will just dry and uh, rot on the plant and end up falling off anyways. And we'll take another one, this curved piece here, I think. There's not really a wrong place to cut one. Um, it's all in how you want to shape it. I don't know if I want to cut that one, I like the way it it looks. Um, I think I'm going to cut this little one down here. It's already branching off of the other one. So now that I have this, a good rule to do with any of your cuttings is to remove most of the leaves and leave just the upper couple piece leaves. Uh, that's to slow the evaporation of water out of the cutting and to allow it to put more energy into rooting. And this is a type of coleus. I don't, I don't know the actual names of either of these. I just know the types of plants. Um, this one I could probably take 10 cuttings and the plant wouldn't even care. There's so many in here. Um, so it's, it's a similar process on this one. The nodes are just not as obvious. Um, so this one I'm going to take right down to the stem here. And then cut that piece off so that the cutting is just below. And one of the other things on these, if you see all these little shoots, you want to rub those off for whatever is going to be in the water so that it doesn't end up rotting in your water. that and I'm going to take a few more actually I'm going to cut this whole piece off here and take another cutting off of that so those are those and then you can see here on the this part of the plant it was cut here and then now there's all this new growth coming out from that cut. So it'll do that again and rebound just perfectly fine. All these pieces here that are there will strengthen up and grow tall again. So that's pretty much it. Um, if you have any questions on any of this type of cutting or anything else related to houseplants, feel free to leave a comment below and please like our video and share. Uh, have a great day.